Getting any more cargo out to Cuba. Good. You somehow managed to piss off both the communists and the gangsters. Word is Pops Holland is seriously fucked thanks to you. Best way to make a crook squirm is to hurt his money. Huh. <laughs> yeah. I heard Frank Pagani told Pops to get his ass back to the freight yard. Pops isn't going anywhere until you're dealt with. I understand he's a hard motherfucker. He's a survivor. Thanks for looking out, Pablo. But I dealt with a lot worse than Pops. Go get that commie loving piece of shit, Holland. Just back me up. Get him off my back! Open up, bitch! You got Oh! 
Open up, bitch! You about to get fucked! You are... Boy knows how to sh I spotted him. Pulled up stakes. Must be hiding somewhere. Rip this place apart. I want his ass now. I'm not out of line here, Pops. But we shouldn't be working with those communist fucks. Get the fuck off me, you big son of a bitch! Of course. If we're gonna hold Tickfall Harbor, I'm gonna need some of your guys. Indeed. I'm your man. I got this area covered, no question about it. How are you, Mr. Clay? I can't believe some of the shit we've got. It's like
I got a hit from the device you put on Frank Pagani's car, which means he's back in town. <laughs> bet he's pretty excited to make your acquaintance. I bet he is. <laughs> Signal's clean so you can take it from here. Just use the tracker I gave you. Catch you later. Looks like the place. My daddy, my uncles. Sure, they saw some action, but they always came out whole. What's your point, kid? Just feels like I missed out on the best times. Golden age. Don't fool yourself. Golden age still got a lot of folks dead. One way or another. It looked like his age 20 years. Between Castro. Huh? Between Castro, the coon, and the 50 G's of bad paper inside, I can kind of see why. I 
I guess we spooked to hell. Fuck was that? What was that noise? Big mistake, asshole! Get me out of here!
Never did anything to you. Saw some interesting stuff back there. Counterfeit money, a press. Only thing I can't figure out is a connection to Cuba. Please. I'm all busted up inside. I need a doctor. I got a wife and three little girls. Hey, you want a doctor? Then you better tell me something worth hearing. Listen, what you saw. Sal set all that up. None of the money was worth a shit, though. They had me bring in a man named Alvarez, counterfeiter who works for Castro. He give you the plates, too? Plates? I thought you knew. On account of robbery. Robbery? <laughs> Marcano wanted the plates from the Federal Reserve. How do I find Alvarez? Uh, How? Well, one of Tommy's guys picked him up. It was... 10, 15 minutes before you showed up. Where are they taking him? Uh, Where? Huh? My little girls. No.
I've spent the last 48 years pursuing Lincoln Clay because he's a criminal. It's horrible what happened to him, but you know something? I think that when Sammy, Ellis, and Danny Burke were killed, it revealed who Lincoln Clay really was. A monster. All right, let's get this over with. I'm done with Frank Pagani. The poor bastard's not gonna be running anything through Tickfall Harbor again. It's our territory now. Fuck him and fuck her. I've got nothing to speak of but Irish Point. And now that I give it a good think, since my Irish bastards have already secured the rackets at your fucking request, I think I'll just stay. Shit didn't play out my way last time. I did everything you asked, and still, nothing. Eventually, I'll get over it, but sliding this district my way would sure speed up the process. Haitians are calling the shots through the city right now, and it's a beautiful thing. No reason this district shouldn't have some Haitian beauty in it as well. <laughs> Sammy raised you right, lad. Trust your instincts. Feels like a knife is being twisted in my fucking back. Can't go wrong here, brother, as long as you lean my way. <laughs> well, this is all said and done. Think about who you want standing at your back. This one's all you, Bert. Motherfucker! This right here, pal, it ain't fucking okay! You hear me? Shut your fucking mouth and show some fucking respect, Vito. Don't fucking say another goddamn word unless it's to apologize or give me some action. I'm tired of being fucked like some $3 hooah. Show the man some fucking respect, Vito. I've heard enough, Vito. And I'll take it into consideration. Y'all don't have to like the decisions I make. And to be honest, your egos are the least of my fucking concerns. Way I see it, you fall in line or you fall out altogether. Now let's go make some fucking money. Look, I gave you some names, and I'm paying you to chase them down, so don't give me any of that bullshit. Yeah, okay, just get it done. Christ, sometimes I think you want something done right. You all right? The night he... Sammy was so happy. Happier than I ever seen him. That money was supposed to get him, get all of us out from under Marcano. Mother... What the hell did Frank tell you? Marcano had us rob the reserve so we could get his hand on a set of money plates. Georgie must have grabbed him during the robbery. I should have been paying attention. We already had this conversation. None of this is your fault. Like hell it isn't. Sal is a cancer. A leech. He had always intended to fuck all of you. Christ, look what he did to Vito. He murdered your family. The only way to make that right is by killing every cocksucker who's ever looked at that piece of shit. Give me some of that bourbon. According to Pagani, Marcano couldn't print the money himself, so he had a Cuban counterfeiter named Alvarez brought in. What do we know about South Downs? Tommy Marcano isn't the kind of guy who shits where he eats, so his rackets are pretty low-key. He runs a sports book and has a place where he stores his contraband. Tommy's got to know that I'm coming after Alvarez, so he's probably got him holed up in or near one of those places. One way or another, I'll get my hands on him. I'll be damned if I let Marcano print a single fucking dollar from one of those plates. That boy's clothes are so out of style. I'm waiting for him. To... 
I'm running low. Can you send supplies to Del Rey Hollow? I'll head your way now. Anything you want here? Show me what you got. I'll be... This is done. You know how to find me.
You cook? My ma's bucatini recipe. I know. Thought I'd give it a try. She back in Empire Bay? No, she, uh, she passed a while ago. You got any folks back there? Take a look at that paper. Some city councilman's up for re-election. I need a favor. Who is he? You tired of Marcano? This fuck. Him and his pals killed a friend of mine. Look, he'd see me coming from a mile away. Oh, yeah, because I'm so inconspicuous. You know how to get to people. It's taken me 12 years and a lot of money to find this cocksucker. I'd make it worth your while. And I'd consider it a personal favor. I'll think about it. If you're having trouble finding him, look for somebody on the street might be willing to give him up. When you're done, come back here. You got a lot more names need to be X'd out. First motherfucker I want you to hit is Lucky. He gets the name on account of he ain't got none. Luck, that is. You're gonna tell me where I can find the councilman. Lucky's supposed to be playing cards here. I might need you. Stay close. We have to go. We have to get out of here. Please, no. Y'all need to get down here right away. Please be advised. We got anyone to call off the cops in Frisco Fields? Right away. All available units, respond immediately.
What? Nothing to see here. Die. Go for cover! Throw him! Come on! I'll die for violating your civil rights. Ciao, amico. Thanks for taking care of that thing. I might have another job for you later. <laughs> 